don't know much about it, but can I just ask a question? Mm-hmm. Can't you just split up Jerusalem 50-50? <laughs> it is already split up. 50-50. <laughs> I don't know Actually, if it's 50-50, it but is, it's... Well, for example, the old is city, which is the really the part that everyone's fighting over. Well, I don't want to say that. But everybody's really obsessed with the old city, which is the biblical part of the city. Mm-hmm. And that is cut up into perfect quarters from after World War II with like mm-hmm. the Christians, the Jews, the Muslims. And there's another group that I mean, like the Genonites or some weird one that nobody really. <laughs> wow. They just got hooked know. up. So that's what. So they it is split up like yeah. by groups. E- e- uh, uh, East Jerusalem, you don't. That's that's air. That's all Arabic. There's a ah. lot of there's a lot of places where you see everyone coexisting. Well, but right. the the problem is the extremes on mm. both sides. Mm. The the Orthodox Jewish people and cause extreme, trouble. Uh, yeah. And the terrorists. Terrorists. Yeah. Uh, well, you, you know, know who do all the terror attacks on the other side, they yeah. cause the trouble. Yeah. But I feel like if you ask most people, especially my age, they'll be like, just do whatever it takes. Just they don't fucking do care. It. Split They're, it. Do you know, the two kind two state solution? Yeah. Do whatever it takes. I mean, right. there was a cab driver in in Beirut who had a fucking tattoo of Hitler on his stomach. Really? So I that's, have to say it was so fucking nice. shocking. Amongst the Arab world, huh. anti-Semitism is very real. Yeah, but I'm not gonna say if it's warranted. I don't know. They fucking always hated the Jews. They always. I don't. I don't know, but like we're not going to solve the problem. Yeah, here. we're not solving I'll tell you that right now. But um, but you that know doesn't surprise me. It's good to just to kind of talk about it yeah. because it it is um, it's it remains to be one of the just um, dilemmas of the world that mm-hmm. we have to deal with, mm-hmm. and it may never be resolved. It doesn't sound like it will ever be resolved. I don't think it will. Ever you know, be the closest resolved. we ever got, we had this. Uh, what was his name? The the Israeli Prime Minister. The one who got shot, yeah, yeah. Uh, Robin. Robin was that his name? <laughs> there was this guy. He was really close to achieving peace with the Palestinians, and get and who killed him? A uh, a, a Jew, Jewish guy, a fundamental Jew, <sighs> who thought, "Fuck these guys, let's not make peace," and he took him out. Mm. It's not as if they're making money, or a, there's no money tied to it. It really is, you know, strictly about God, the right? Religious. Yeah, the religion. The religion. Well, the, yeah. the Palestinians are definitely being fucked by everybody. Like they, are, that's got to be one of the worst places to live in the whole world. Is yeah. Gaza specifically? Yeah. Gaza, Gaza specifically, yeah. yeah. And and the thing about Gaza is that like Egypt's got the border closed, Israel's got the border closed, and Israel despite having given up like autonomy whatever they still control they still control it yeah they regularly go in there and kill terrorists they control the water and the power and all this shit wow so is there mcdonald's there in gaza possibly i think there might be like a starbucks like if i was there could i go to a starbucks you might the some of the images i've seen are strikingly civilized wow but it's still fucked because you've got like how many people there I don't know the exact number, but it's it's the most dense place in the world. Mm. Wow! It's just packed. Unemployment's like fifty percent. But a the, lot of drug the, problems. The, re- the regular people there are. I mean, everyone feels bad for them, even on you know the Jewish side. Oh yeah. And they're just. What can you do? They they're just because stuck there. Hamas is like. And, yeah. There's videos of like people celebrating a wedding in Gaza, and then Hamas rolls up and is like, no celebrating. And fucking shut like their Hamas is insane. Insane. Yeah. And then people try to give money to Gaza, and the government empowers Hamas, and they take the money and they use yeah. it to build weapons. Mm-hmm. So it's oh like you're fucked. God. They're you're really fucked. fucked on on all sides. Yeah, yeah. It's just one of those sad things that you just you know I you know I think about it sometimes, and I just go, there is no solution, and that makes me even sadder, really, to be honest with you. <sighs> what are we gonna do? I mean, I don't know where. No, I lived there for. Look at look at look at look at look at what you think I did that? <laughs> you think I, I you think I brought this conversation into this area? No, I'm fully a thousand percent interested. Yeah. I'm <clears throat> part of the reason I left is because I was like, this is too much. Like it's so like just having just living there and being on YouTube is just so polarizing to people. Yeah. Like when, like honestly when we started doing YouTube, we hid the fact that we were in Israel. Oh. oh. Because we just were like we didn't want Oh, so that you being... started H3 in Israel? Yeah. Mm-hmm. No, oh. the podcast? No, no, no. Not the podcast has been around for like a year. Oh, yeah. the vi- you but guys have been videos. videos for like 5 years. Yeah. Wow. What kind of videos would you make? Is it like like a podcast or was it sketches and stuff? Sketches, comedy, oh, cool. shit mm-hmm. like that. Oh, yeah. wow. So, we had like 
I remember we would like cover Hebrew writing mm. and wow. shit like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we were just like, oh, I don't want people to know. Just because we didn't want to necessarily be. We don't want to be about that. About that. Yeah, 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 yeah. We yeah. wanted it to, you know, not be boxed into this like, oh, you support Israel. Not, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. And and and. Because it's so complicated. To a lot of people, I have a good friend who is uh, Lebanese, and to him, the simple even the simple fact that I went to Israel to live with my wife is enough to make for him to have disassociated with me. Wow. wow. And it's like, dude, I'm not going there for political reasons. I'm literally going there to be with my wife because I don't have an option. Yeah. That to him is like wow, that's heavy. enough to disassociate with me. Yeah, and also you're a and coward. Also, like I am. I'm a coward, bro. Yeah, I'm not yeah, fucking yeah. shooting. Yeah. He also couldn't come to a wedding because he's... He was like my closest really? friend and he was in Lebanon, which is just, you know, so close to... Yeah, yeah it really yeah, is so yeah. close. Oh, you guys got married in Israel? Yes. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Well, we had to. Yeah. For the green, for that green card. It's so funny because <laughs> it's like, you know, aside from like uh, uh, the religious <laughs> stuff and, you know, whatever, I'm Korean. She's Filipino. What do you... He's a... He grew up in... A really weird Christian religion. What was it called? Seventh Day Seventh Adventist. Adventist. Seventh Day Adventist. Which one Adventist. is that? That's a weird one, right? Oh uh, yeah, we uh, worship on the seventh day, follow kosher rules, mm. a lot of vegetarian. Oh no, yeah. weird, no no weird like sexual stuff. Oh no. God bless. It's just they're not allowed. To, <laughs> they're not allowed to dance yeah. though. They're not allowed to no, like, dancing. Yeah. Footloose. Do you dance yeah, now? Are you still basically. part? Are you yeah, still yeah. religious? No. Do you, do you enjoy dancing now more than like most? <laughs> Only to reggae. But, yeah. Uh, yeah. Reggae. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Bryce, Bryce grew up with it too, right? Yeah. yeah Seventh yeah. day at oh. God bless. You guys are good old boys, right? Where are you from? <laughs> <laughs> Michigan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Good old they boy. are good old boys. Mm. But, he, old but listen, like, look, like, listen to this. This is incredible. Yes, we got these freaks, right? We got this freak. We got, mm. you know, you, we got, right? We're mm. all from different parts of everywhere right mm -hmm. yeah. different ideologies and if we don't think about that and we're just around each other and we're just talking mm -hmm. we're just we're just regular yeah. human beings yeah and, 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 why the yeah and, no and why it's, it's the, so it, it's really frustrating because that and like the way i always thought about it is like i'm just i was just born here right. i yeah. i right. don't care like i don't know the history and i don't care we're mm -hmm. all like, just people here yeah People and now give, I have to choose sides and I have to mm -hmm. that's like, the, and I was saying that's why the reason I left is because like I'm like this isn't my fight and Ela I think since before she knew thought it wasn't her fight she never belonged there and it's like I don't really want to be involved in in this because when you live in Israel you start to learn things or maybe you're I don't know if it's a brainwashing thing or you're just you're with the the club right you're right. with that tribe mm -hmm. yeah so it gets through to you yeah so before i went to israel i was very pro-palestinian because i went to a very liberal college I went to uc santa cruz and there it's like they literally have protests on the campus of like israeli soldiers executing palestinians mm -hmm. wow. and i was like okay yeah that's totally what it is mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. but when you go there and then you learn because you spend time with that tribe and you understand all their talking points and shit and it's, it's just so confusing dude yeah I mean, I got, even by go visiting, doing this tourist thing, mm -hmm. I posted a couple of photos because mm -hmm. that was a part of the deal. Mm -hmm. And the backlash of me just going <laughs> right. was yeah. insane. Yeah. yeah. Right? It's propaganda. I can't believe you took chose sides. I go, I just wanted a free trip to the Dead Sea, man. <laughs> but you're, I wanted like, to float on the, on the sea yeah. without any fucking effort. Yeah. Yeah. The salt, the salt. <laughs> so heavily salty, you just float. But it's so, I hate that because it's so counterproductive. It's like, how are we going to make progress? If you're telling people you can't even go there and talk to them because you go there and you talk to them, you learn about them, you learn what you know what's an interesting perspective. Yeah, it's like what am I just supposed to shut out that whole part and just take your word for it? Yeah, like what the mm -hmm. fuck do you know? Yeah, it's crazy. It really is crazy, but um, but we're here. Yeah, <laughs> we're now. You know, when when yeah. Ela's brother <laughs> lives here, Ela's brother is Israeli, and he said to us just the other day, he's like. I meet Palestinians here all the fucking time, and we love each other. We always get along here. Yeah, it's yeah. just over there that we all hate each other. It's mm. crazy. I have a friend. I have several friends that are Muslim, mm -hmm. and it never comes up. I never talk about it. Mm -hmm. You don't even think about it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and they're just loving <laughs> people. I know so many Jewish people. They're just the most nicest, loving mm -hmm. people. Mm -hmm. And it's like, and then when you hear about this conflict, it just boggles the fucking mind. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I'm just, you know, 
I'm not a part of it. I'm just observing, but I'm a part of humanity and a part of the human race. Mm -hmm. And I just want, you know, what Rodney King said. I forgot what he said. <laughs> <laughs> I want what he, he said. said you yeah, remember yeah. the spirit of what he said. Yeah, 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 yeah. I forgot what he said. Something about, <laughs> but he said something about <laughs> having a dream. People and stuff. People, yeah, people right? are great. And, people and are great. People, yeah, people are great. I love people. That's what he said. Yeah. People are great and I love people. people yeah. Right. Love it. And if we just abided by what yeah. that guy, that black guy said. Remember him. Right.